everybody. We thank you for joining us on the PIX 11 Morning News. It's Tuesday, November 10th. I'm John Muller. Good morning. I'm Vanessa Freeman. All right, we are hitting the repeat button because yeah. we may have another gorgeous day on tap. Love it. <laughs> yes, let's check in with Marissa Torres, who has a look at our weather and our traffic yeah. on this Tuesday. Hey, Marissa. A nice little bundle for everybody to get you started. Yeah, I mean, yesterday we actually tied the record in Central Park at 75 degrees. It was a glorious day of sunshine, and today we're going to start off mostly sunny and dry. Now, looking at the temperatures right now, look at this. We're at 62, 62 degrees as we kick off this morning at 430. 58 over in Hoboken, 52 Highland, Lindenhurst, you're at 51. This is a wonderful launch. Colorado is live in uh, Jersey City, New Jersey, uh, as Governor Phil Murphy announced new restrictions. Katie? Colorado is live in uh, Jersey City, New Jersey, uh, as Governor Phil Murphy announced new restrictions. Katie? Tuesday, November 10th. Time right now is 5:30, and take a look at that temperature: 62 Ooh. degrees. I'm John. Can you believe it? Yeah. It only gets better from here, right? Uh -huh. Good morning, folks. I'm Vanessa Freeman. Uh, here's it this morning. So satellite radar picture: it is dry. We do have fog out there, primarily east and interior portions of New Jersey. But this is the front that's going to be bringing us rain tomorrow. So enjoy one more dry day with the sunshine. Right. Biden has promised to be a leader for all Americans and to bridge the deep divide we've seen in our country. Well, that may certainly be an uphill battle. In fact, something bridging that divide could be impossible. PIX 11's Andrew Ramos has a can tunnel. All the construction wrapped up, everybody coming in through the helix, in through the tolls, and things are moving well. But notice it is picking up already at this early hour. So if you have to hit the road, you might as well do it soon. We have a live look at the Cross Bronx Expressway. It is a quiet commute out here for the most part. This is coming from the Bruckner Interchange and continuing on towards the Bronx River Parkway. So you are noticing some minor slowdowns, but it's really just due to volume, that eastbound side that's cooperating. So we do have some delays that are starting to build. So this is out. You're noticing once you get past 109 on the westbound side, pretty heavy there. We do have a crash blocking at least one lane. Once you get past it and continue on towards the Seaford Oyster Bay Expressway, things are actually moving okay there. But otherwise, it is going to be a little bit of a slow stretch there. Uh, alternate side of the street parking, it is in effect today Off on the maps. This is out in Bedminster, New Jersey. So 78 eastbound as you head towards 287. It's a crash hearing an overturned truck at this point. So From new basketball courts to urban farms, changes are coming to the city's public housing developments. PIX 11's Monica Morales shows us how this program will help renovate and create new open spaces across NYCHA community. 701, we'll talk about the commute. So the Southern State Parkway is still slow westbound as you head towards Route 110. That is because of a crash from Earl. We okay. will. Oh, he's going to be married by tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in the meantime, let's get you over to meteorologist Byron Miranda. Can, can I use some of that? Cases on the rise there. Yeah, he says he hopes to bring down those numbers. Central as Parks there saluting our nation's veterans and Golden Star families with free access to so many of our landmarks. Yeah, Veterans Day is commemorated. Out in the wilderness, okay? Okay, yeah, and what you'll hear... Well, Ben, you've been hearing something strange. One of many, my friends, yeah. and today's shut the front door. <laughs> yes. Like at it oh, gosh, so cute. All right, Macy's Herald Square using its world famous holiday window. Macy's window during the yeah. holiday, right? I'm hoping they took the boards down. They were boarded up last week because of the, um, you know, the, the fear of what was going to happen, but. I don't know if they took the boards down yet. I don't know. I I, I know Shake Shack was boarded up down the street. Oh, you know? <laughs> Betty. That's true, true. She knows that. I, I, All of New York City, she knows that the Shake Shack was boarded up. <laughs> it better not have closed. Yeah. Oh, gosh. No, Betty's they, like, I'm going to ambush Krispy Kreme. They better have those boards up. Please don't board up Krispy Kreme. <laughs> They boarded up because they knew you were coming. Yeah, that's, yeah. I don't blame them. Hey, let's get to meteorologist Byron Miranda. Yeah, asking. Is there a photo of the girl? No, those are to come. There's a, oh. It's a set of six. Oh, goodness. Don't you worry. There'll be a face down. every day coming up. <laughs>